While it is being speculated that Apple isn't focusing on its next OS update, new reports suggest otherwise. Seems like the Cupertino-based tech company has shifted its entire attention on the upcoming iOS 17, which is set to come out in a few months ahead of the release of iPhone 15 lineup. EU lawmakers are giving Apple's arm a final twist to enable third-party app installs in its walled garden, and this time, the Cupertino tech giant has no choice but to comply. The iPhone maker is already hard at work implementing permissions in iOS 17 for alternate app stores that customers can use to sideload third-party apps, like how Android users can install a third-party app file to their device without restrictions, Bloomberg reported this week. The move comes after the European Union's Digital Markets Act DMA, took effect last month, requiring so-called gatekeeper companies to open up their platforms to third-party app venues. The change would enable iPhone and iPad users to download software that hasn't passed Apple's safety checks for privacy and security, as well as benefit developers looking to monetize products without paying a tribute to the Cupertino giant. As legislators pressured Apple over the years to soften restrictions inside its ecosystem, the company has repeatedly maintained that sideloading will eventually undermine privacy and security protections built by design into iOS, leaving customers vulnerable to malware infections, scams, spyware and other ills. As security concerns will likely increase in scale and scope, iPhone and iPad users may soon find it more important to deploy a dedicated security solution on their devices. Previous reports had revealed that Apple is working on iOS 17 under the codename Dawn, which is currently under testing and development. Before rolling out the official version of the operating software for the world, Apple will roll out the beta version of iOS 17 for testing. iOS 17 will be previewed at the Worldwide Developers Conference in June 2023. After WWDC, iOS 17 will be made available to developers for testing purposes, with a public beta likely to come out sometime in July. Following the beta testing period, iOS 17 will see a launch in September 2023 alongside new iPhones. iPhones usually get 5 years of software updates, with iPhone 6s being a shining exception here, so we expect that iOS 17 will go back to 2018, being available on iPhone XS and up. It remains to be seen whether Apple will make such a change. Ultimately, the decision will likely be influenced by a variety of factors, including legal and regulatory considerations, as well as Apple's own business priorities and strategic vision for its ecosystem. And that's it for our discussion on iOS 17 and sideloading apps. As we've seen, iOS 17 will bring about exciting changes that will allow users to sideload apps with ease. While we don't have an exact release date for iOS 17 yet, we can expect it to be available sometime in the near future. So, whether you're a developer looking to test your apps or a user looking to explore new apps outside of the App Store, iOS 17 will offer a new level of flexibility and convenience. Thank you for joining me today, and I hope you found this discussion helpful. 